Hey, what's up beautiful people? Welcome to the Esoteric Coaching Channel. In today's video, I'm gonna attempt to do an extended water fast. So stick along with me on my journey and see if I make it and if I can lose a couple pounds, shed some old ideas that I no longer need and develop a new healthier mindset towards life. So if you're ready, let's go. Alright, welcome to my water fasting video. It is currently 11.30 a.m. December 9th on a Saturday. I am five and a half hours fasted in the very beginning of the water fast. Now, unfortunately, I do not have a scale with me. I left it at my friend's house, so I'm not gonna be able to weigh myself on a daily basis. So we're purely gonna go on how I feel, and you know basically what changes do i think i'm seeing in my body now i am going to the gym right now to work out so they do have a scale there so i will step on the scale see how much i weigh with all my clothes on it'll be a little bit off but that's okay and i'll come back and give you guys an update and a little bit more about how i feel so uh, i'm gonna head to the gym and i'll be right back what's up guys so i just got back from the gym feeling pretty good I weighed myself on the scale of the gym. I was 187 pounds, but when I got home, I remembered that I had an old scale that I hadn't sold yet, so I stepped on the scale. So check this out. This is how much my scale says I weigh. So as you can see, 187.6, I believe, somewhere around there. So very similar to what I weighed at the gym. So from now on, I'm actually gonna use that scale to weigh myself every single day and I'll update you guys as the fast goes along. Now, just a couple of guidelines for the fast. I decided when I was in the gym, I wanna shoot for 100 hours. So I'm going for at least four days and I wanna go for five, 120 hours. That's my goal. So that's what I'm shooting for. Um, I'm only gonna be drinking water and black coffee on this fast. No BCAAs, no multivitamins, nothing else. And when it comes to exercise, I'm gonna go by how my body feels. So. If I feel good, I'm gonna go to the gym. If I feel tired, I'm gonna rest. Simple as that. Besides that, um, you know, everything else, I'm gonna try to keep things organic. So no, um, you know, no type of deodorant that has aluminum, no type of lotion that has any type of uh, things in there that are aren't good for my body is I want to keep everything 100% organic so I can help my body heal. I'm not just doing this for weight loss. I'm doing this to, you know, make my insulin sensitivity better, you know, reset my immune system, clean out my lungs, you know, scrub my colon and all that stuff. Get all rid of all the extra stuff because a lot of amazing things can happen while fasting. So I'm only nine hours into it, so there's nothing really to report here. I'm actually going to have to go teach a yoga class, and I decided I'm going to take yoga yoga afterwards, it's gonna be like a 100 degree class. Really great to sweat out everything from my system as I start, clean out my system. And I'll check in with you guys a little bit later when I come back at night. So I'll see you guys in the PM. What's up guys, just got back from yoga a little bit ago, feeling pretty good, about 15 hours fasted at this point. So nothing major to report here, very early on into the fast. But I did have two workouts in, I'm not super hungry hungry feeling pretty good i fast for about 20 hours every day so right now this portion is pretty easy um i can tell that i'm going to be hungry soon because I, I did finish two workouts and i did finish teaching yoga class so i'm definitely hungry but i just got to get over this first hump and everything should get easier from here so because there's nothing really major to report here it's going to be pretty early so i'm not going to be doing that much i'm just going to check in with you guys tomorrow morning for day two um, and we'll see how much I weigh and we'll check in with how I feel. So I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Well, bam, it's the next day. I am 32 hours fasted right now at this point. So I just stepped on a scale a couple minutes ago. Check this out, this is how much I weigh. So as you guys can see, I have dropped about four pounds so far. Nothing really extreme to be honest because a lot of that's just blow and water weight. So I'm excited to see what happens after the next 24 to 48 hours to see where the weight goes. But um, I actually have to go teach two yoga classes right now. Um, I just woke up a little bit ago, I said like 11 hours. Um, I'm about to have black coffee, some water, go teach two yoga classes, come back, and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna go to the gym, so I feel pretty good today, so I'll do my third workout of my fast. And yeah, so it is, you know, still pretty early in the day, so I'll check in with you guys when I come back from yoga class before I go to the gym. So I'll see you guys in like six hours. 
Hey guys, what's up? Uh, I just got back from teaching yoga, feeling pretty good. Um, I put on all my gym clothes, I'm fully gymmed out, but right now I'm not sure if I'm gonna work out or not yet. Uh, I told you guys I'm listening to my body, and right now I'm not exactly sure if it's good for me to rest or work out, so I'm gonna have a coffee and relax. Um, <clears throat> like I said, I'm 40 hours into my fast, which is about 33 to 40, 40% done, depending if I go for 120 hours or 100. Um, so it's pretty good, you know, treading along. The weight hasn't changed since this morning. I just weighed myself, but besides that, things are pretty chill, nothing too crazy. I'm a little tired from the heated rooms and the yoga, but besides that, everything's all good. So I am gonna rest for a little bit, and then before I go to bed, I'll check in with you guys one more time and let you know if I worked out and how the rest of my night went. So I'll talk to you guys very soon. Good morning guys, it's actually the next day. I ended up not making that video last night, but I am 56 hours fasted right now, so we're past the halfway mark. Um, I woke up today, as you can see, I weigh 180 pounds, which means I'm seven and a half pounds down um, from about two and a half days. So that's a pretty good start. Um, we'll see what happens when I go one more day. Um, I didn't go to the gym last night, Today I slept a pretty good amount of time and I'm going to rest and I'm going to go to jujitsu tonight at 6 o'clock. So I am going to work out today. Um, if I feel really good, maybe I'll go to the gym beforehand, but I, I want to save my energy for jujitsu. I, I want to train. So I'm going to have about to have a morning coffee, drink some water, and just kind of rest today and just take it really easy. Um, the longest I've ever gone fasting is 80 hours, so if I can just make it through today, I'm guaranteed to beat my record. So that's my only goal, is just make it through today, make it through three days, regenerate my entire immune system. So our body goes through something called autophagy, which is when our body starts to eat old cells for energy. So we attack dead cells and cells that aren't very like healthy first. Our body doesn't attack our healthy muscles and skins first. It attacks things that are you know not doing so well. So what it does is that for some reason, when we fast for three days, our white blood cells kind of disappear. And after three days of fasting, your body starts making new white blood cells. The stem cell production starts going into effect. And you, when you eat again, the white blood cells come back, but they're healthier. So basically after today, my immune system will be reset. And day four and five is when I should start seeing some really cool things happen. So I'm gonna just, Kick back for today, have my coffee, and I'll check in with you guys a little bit later. Hey, what up guys? I just got back from Jiu Jitsu a little bit ago. I am currently 65 hours fasted at this point, only 15 hours away from beating my record. Feeling pretty pumped, uh, you know, Jiu Jitsu was pretty mellow today, so luckily that was perfect for where I was at. I was hesitating even going, but I made myself go. But I felt really good. Um, the one thing I noticed, I wasn't sweating as much. I was a lot clearer. I had like a uh, pretty euphoric state as I was driving over there. I just felt like I was really in the moment. I, and I finally understand what people say where they, when they're fasting and they say like they were doing things but didn't really feel like they were the ones doing it. I kind of got a moment of that where I was just like noticed that my I was on autopilot and I was like doing it, but I was also watching it. It was very interesting. So um, yeah, 65 hours fasted, very close to breaking my record. I'm gonna take it easy tonight and I'll check with you guys tomorrow. My weight is still the same, so hopefully tomorrow when I wake up, the weight drops a little bit. So I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Good morning, guys. It is day four of my water fast. I am 83 hours into the fast now and I feel amazing. I woke up today not hungry. Uh, feeling really really good last night was the first night. I really really struggled I had like really bad summer pain before I went to bed I really wanted to eat and I kind of like fought through it and I fell asleep Luckily when I woke up this morning, um, I weighed myself and as you guys can see I weighed 177 pounds which means I'm about 11 pounds down total on these three four days water fast um, I'm gonna take it easy today about to go shoot some YouTube videos with a friend of mine and just chill out so it's gonna be pretty easy. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna break my 100. I already broke my record, so I'm already past my old record of 80 hours. And now I'm shooting for 100. As long as I make it through tonight, I'll be done. I'll be almost on my way to a five day full fast. So I'll check in with you guys a little bit later with some more updates. For now, we're good. What's up, guys? So it's officially 90 hours. I'm officially 90 hours fasted. I can't believe it has been four days. I mean, it's Tuesday night and I haven't eaten since Friday night. That's a long time. That's pretty trippy. Um, this is the first time I've really gotten hungry this whole day. It was like an hour ago. Um, kind of struggled with it. Still kind of am. 
but I'm on the last stretch. I've already broken my past goal by 10 hours. As long as I go to bed tonight, it'll be four full days. So I'm just gonna keep holding on. I haven't been drinking that much water, five to six cups, two cups of coffee. So I'll drink some more water before I sleep. But I'm gonna call tonight and check with you guys tomorrow. I think the weight loss tomorrow will be pretty cool. I'm already 11 pounds down, so any more than this is just extra, you know, log to fuel the fire, if you know what I mean. And it didn't make sense, cause probably because I'm fasting, but I'll see you guys tomorrow. What's up, guys? It is day number five of my water fast. I am officially 103 hours into the fast. That is over four days of no food. I haven't eaten since Friday night and it is Wednesday morning. Freaking nuts. So I woke up today, I was 176 pounds, which means I'm about 12 pounds down for this water loss. Pretty good. Um, last night I was definitely struggling. I was feeling really, really hungry and I just kept telling myself, just go to bed and you'll wake up and it'll be 100 hours, so I'm glad I did. Uh, last night I slept the least I have during this fast, but I woke up today feeling just as good as any other day. I've been waking up every day feeling amazing. Um, this is the first day I woke up and actually had like hunger, like actual hunger. So I'm dealing with that right now. Um, had my morning coffee, had a little bit of water. So we'll definitely be breaking the fast either later today or tomorrow morning. It's at the very end of it and the last legs. So I'll update you guys very soon. Know that I'm feeling good and that I'm glad that I've made it this far and I'm just trying to push myself a little bit further. So I'll update you guys in a little bit with my final weight for this water fast. Thanks for sticking along. We're almost there. Let's get to it. See you guys in a second. All right, guys, so it is the end of my fast. I am 108 hours into my fast. I'm looking pretty shredded right now. Looking pretty good. Probably dropped around 2% body fat, so not a bad way to end the fast. Even shoulder veins popping out, so I'm really excited to eat. See what happens in my body. So I have bought, as you guys saw right now in this video, I have bought three things of fruit. I bought watermelon, mango, and pineapple. So I am gonna start with the watermelon and really enjoy it, have one of each to end my fast. So as you guys saw, 176 pounds this morning, so a total of 12 pounds down. I have drinking only about 65 to 75 ounces of water a day for the past four days. So very little water, had a cup or two cups of coffee every single day. One thing that's very interesting about this fat is I haven't pooped once. So since the start of my fast, the first day, I had regular bowel movement, and since then I haven't. So I know that once I eat this food, it is gonna stimulate that, and I'm probably going to the bathroom, which is why I'm breaking my fast in the middle of the afternoon rather than the morning or night, because I wanna work out tonight, and I don't wanna break it right before and end up having stomach problems while training. So I'm gonna break it now. I'm pretty proud of myself. 108 hours, four and a half days is the longest I've ever gone. 12 pounds down, feeling really good, feeling really mentally strong, physically fit. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I'm part of Esoteric Coaching. I make videos about fitness, self-development, social dynamics, self-improvement. I'm also a life coach. So if you're interested in coaching, hit the link in my description. I can get that set up for you. Do me a favor. If you like this video, make sure to leave it a like. Leave me a comment. Tell me if you've ever done a fast before. How long have you been fasting right now? What kind of results do you want to see from fasting? If you're not a subscriber, Consider subscribing to my channel and make content again about everything I just told you before. I'm always making videos. I'm always trying to do really cool things. I'm really trying to push myself for you guys. So thanks again for watching this video. 108 hours down and I'm about to enjoy my first bait off camera because I'm really going to savor the flavor. Peace out guys.